Hi folks, it's Nessa from Infinitely Zero's channel. So here today, really quick, I came to hop on um, to share our second week of, and I know I'm not doing them weekly, I'm doing them monthly, so this is part two of the informal swatch along that we're using the crochet um, skill building workshop book and I mention it in the other two videos concerning the informal swatch along series and this week we were going to do or you know in the in weeks in between it depends whenever you wanted to do them I'm here to discuss the one that I was going to do which is um, uh, found on page 26 and 27 which is the medium open lace and the very open lace so what we're looking at is the amount of drape this month. So they mentioned to use the same hook size and the same yarn. I used the same one from my other swatches. And to do two different lace stitch patterns. One is like a medium open lace stitch pattern. And this is the one that I did. Um, that's in the book. It's really, it's really pretty. I actually would have liked it probably with um, a thinner yarn or a bigger hook size. I used the 5.5 millimeter hook and this is a uh, more suited category weight for yarn. And this is their page 27, the very open lace. And you can see obviously it has more holes. So if you compare them side to side, you can see this is the medium and this one's the more open lace one. This would make a beautiful shawl and you can just tell it has a little more drape than, than this one. Um, so that's everything that I wanted to show you in case you guys don't have the book and you want to follow along. I will put links in the description box below of this video um, concerning, I think I, I went and I looked for a few video stitch tutorials that would work of lace work that I think would fall in the category of medium and then ones that would fall in the category of open. I decided to go with um, Bag O'Day with her channel. She has a ton of stitch tutorials, so if you don't like the ones that I picked, you can use different ones. I think for the medium lace stitch work, you can try out to do the crochet dragon stitch which looks really cool and really pretty and for the um, more open lace stitch work I chose two instead you know I figured you could choose either of those um, the woven lattice stitch or the Victorian lace wave stitch um, and you know you could either do all three you could just do you know that first one and one of those last two or you can pick whatever you like from her of other, you know, stitches that are there that look that are lacy. Or you can grab um, something out of a stitch dictionary or out of anyone else, you know, that's another different content creator or website that has different lace patterns. Um, and I mean, even like the granny stitch, right, would work as medium open lace stitch work. Um, and then here on this blanket, I have you know, these shells later on with the V, the double V stitches, which are more op open. So you can even tell the difference in that. And this is actually that blanket that I had finished, um, that I did with, uh, the winter cow from Juan, the yarn addicts channel. It was the blanket, um, cow. So this is my finished blanket. So I decided to put it back there for, um, to showcase. So yeah, so that's everything. Um, The next one that's coming up, I, I'll, um, I think I have it written in that last video below. I don't remember it right now. I didn't review it. Um, again, I created a Facebook group. It's private and unlisted, but if you want to join and you have issues, send me a message or send me an email and I will get you joined in there and you can share your swatches with us in there. So we can see or you know make a video of them or post them on facebook too and just tag us so sorry tag me um okay well that's everything for tonight thanks bye